Now, as the Delta Plus variant is now a cause of concern, Maharashtra has recorded over 20 new cases of the mutated virus. After the decline in the COVID cases initially, the state is also now seeing a sudden rise in COVID cases. Here's more on that. The second wave is subsiding, but covid are at it again. They are busy inviting the third wave. These images are from Navi Mumbai, where BJP workers in thousands held protest against the naming of a new international airport. No distancing, no COVID-appropriate behaviour. This at a time when Maharashtra has been reporting a surge in its COVID tally. On Thursday, the state reported nearly 10,000 fresh cases. It has over 1,20,000 active cases. And not to forget, the state is facing a new threat in the form of Delta Plus variant. So far, Maharashtra has over 20 known cases of the mutated virus. 3400 सैंपल में से 21 सैंपल्स डेल्टा पॉजिटिव ये आइडेंटिफाई हुए हैं और वो जलगांव में सात रत्नागिरी में नौ मुंबई में दो और पालगर थाना इन डिस्ट्रिक्ट्स में एक ऐसा कुल मिलाके 21 सैंपल्स नजर आए हैं to stop the situation from getting out of hand, the Uddhav Thakre government has issued a fresh set of guidelines for districts reporting Delta Plus. The government has ordered local administration to decide on restrictions based on the situation in their district. The government has also made it clear that opening up should not be done in a hurry. Meanwhile, health experts are predicting a third wave in next two to three weeks. Some districts in Maharashtra have got a high positivity rate as well as the increase in the growth. And the reason for that obviously is that we need to go back to the same tools which we have adhered to for the last one and a half years. International experts too have called for caution. Based on the data that this virus transmits more easily and can be more dangerous, has been the underlying reason why they've made that change and upgraded it, as it were, to a variant of concern. Additional stringent measures are being seen as the need of the hour. The state government proposes to put new curbs on the movement of people and vehicles, the interstate and intrastate travel, and crowding at marketplaces. The fear is, if more relaxations are given now, there could be sudden spike in COVID cases. With camera person Samir Shanbad, this is Pankaj Upadhyay in Mumbai, reporting for India Today.